2013 looks to be as robust as 2012 in terms of the leasing activity. There was over 200,000 square feet of positive absorption, keeping vacancy just a little over 12% from fourth quarter of 2012 to this year. The office leasing rates have dropped just a hair from $16.80 per square foot to a little over $16 per square foot across all the markets as an average. We're seeing investment activity as strong in 2013 as it was in 2012, which was more activity that we've seen in nationally and locally since 2007. With interest rates where they're at, we're expecting building owners to continue to refinance, but the in investor activity remains strong. Overall activity is up in the first quarter of 2013 in leasing and in investment sales. The investment sale trend has continued with a $98 million national portfolio sale, which included two properties here in Columbus, Ohio, one in Dublin, which was a fully leased 315,000 square foot building leased by Nationwide Insurance, and the Lane Bryant headquarters out in Easton. Technology companies, call centers, medical office users. Those are the trends we're gonna see in 2013. In the medical office users in the first quarter of 2013, we saw Catholic Health Partners, St. Elizabeth Healthcare, and Mercy Health Fitness lease office space in the Cincinnati market. Going forward, we see in 2013 the same trend continuing in those three sectors. Intelligence and Sea Pines were the first two build suits in 2012 that we started seeing a trend by, and that affected the 2013 office market. As a result, we're starting to see more trends like this build suits, like Dunhumby and Paycor. Dunhumby is actually going to do a nice building down in downtown Cincinnati, and Paycor is doing one in Mid City in the Norwood area. The office market in Ohio had a strong first quarter. Overall, total absorption was 692,000 square feet. In Cincinnati, we had over 254,000 square feet of positive absorption. In Columbus, we had 162,000 square feet of positive absorption. In Cleveland, we had 275,000 square feet of positive absorption. Overall, great signs for our office market in Ohio. Vacancy rates continued to fall and rental rates started to creep up. This is good news for owners and landlords starting to take, capitalize and take advantage of this market. Employment in Ohio continues to improve. The unemployment rate in Ohio sits at 7.0% as of January of 2013. This compares to the U.S. national average of 7.9%. Going into the recession, Ohio was 110 basis points above the national average. This is a great story for Ohio. Ohio is putting people back to work and jobs are happening in 